Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Orb on the Movements of the Earth, episode 5. Episode 5, I think? Episode 5, yeah. Um, last episode we were introduced properly to uh, Oxy and Grass, I believe. Uh, I think that's kind of like a, a, a pronunciation um, of like actually grass or glass, I think. I'm not sure yet. Um, but like you know, some kind of localization, I guess. But yeah. Uh, we introduced to them, they are kind of like assassins for hire. Uh, if nobles ever want to like duel each other, they hire these guys to duel in their place. Some nobles didn't get the message properly, apparently, because <laughs> they got fucked up. Um, but yeah, that was interesting. Uh, Oxy is presumably the main-ish character, I guess, of this segment. Um, but he's kind of like a, a glass half full kind of guy. He doesn't see really that much good in the world or anything really. Uh, whereas Grass is the um, the one who's very interested in the stars and the planets. And uh, they are currently transporting a heretic, or they were. And he was like, hey, you want to come see my stash of uh, hidden knowledge? And he's like, fuck yeah, let's go. So yeah, that's interesting. The first time we saw them, they were going through like a forest. And uh, Oxy, I believe, had the wooden ball. So that explains how they got that. But yeah, I'm looking forward to this episode. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's grind this episode right now. Episode 5. Even if I die, this world will continue. I like that. I think his work is just killing, not gonna lie. Oh shit. Ooh. Oh, he just, <laughs> he just threw him off. Boy, oh, he was about to kill him. Well, there's a problem on your watch. You chasing them on foot? Oh, well, okay, never mind. Oh, he was gonna shoot the horse or nah? Oh, damn, good shot. <laughs> damn, that car got fucked up. Damn, he got impaled. Who's gonna lie to him? The heretic took off. Oh, what? Whoa, relax! It wasn't- wasn't us. Wink, wink. Where's the other guy? Where are you, Grass? This man is about that life. Yeah. Smokescreen. <laughs> For voluntary surrender. Oh, do I have to abide by some rules? Ugh. Exercise your own judgment? Oh no. Oh, he's gonna kill you anyway. You may as well fight. Oh, the heretic. Interesting. He's dead anyway. You may as well. Take the ball. Take it. Damn, that's some devotion. Jesus. He died smiling as well. He's gonna throw that shit? Oh my god, he's got good aim. Oh, what a counter. Good job, Grass. Everett just looks like a pain in the ass to him. Oh, so they're just gonna let him go? I mean, he saw one of their faces. I wonder if he knows what uh, Oxy looks like. They don't have the brains of a heresy. Sure, bro. Whatever you say, maybe you should stop uh, underestimating people. Mm, I don't know about that one. You just want to be sure. Oh, wow, what happened to your eye? I can't even remember. Dumb. <laughs> That's further. Bro has a goal. Bro has hope. Bro wants to look to the stars. I get it. Is someone watching them? Or is it just the angle? Found it. How did nobody like how does nobody like stumble upon this? Like it's so far out of the way. Eventually people would like find it. Probably not good people either. Oh, is this letter? Raphael. Oh boy. You gotta read it. One is dated recently? What? Oh, okay, yeah. How did this guy come about finding Raphael's wooden thing then? 
ここ一帯で一番の観測地を見つけたすると不思議なことに気づいたおおおさやすそこにある二つの大岩のそれぞれに一体そこに何が誰が and from that he was like oh there must be something there damn 好奇心に未完成ながら人類の歴史と運命を変えてしまうもの so did he not read the letter that Raphael left? Surely that would explain who left the chest. His life was fortunate. Damn. He can't read. Damn. I expected that. What does that say? Oh. Oh, okay. Interesting. Did they, did they say that in like the previous episode? Oh, I can't remember. Have they, have they read the content? So are they just leaving it? Um, rubber. Yeah, keep it. I think if uh, Noah sees this, though, he's gonna be like, oh, I know what you're up to. Yeah. <laughs> Is he taking a look at them? Oh shit, he's got to get someone to translate it. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely don't let it be anybody from the church. Badeni. Ooh, interesting. We like that. Definitely. Yeah, a bit of a point, but aren't you interested in why that guy gave his life for you? He really can't like make his own decisions, can he? Damn. Does he know how to do that? I'm sorry, why? What? He... What? He doesn't look at the sky? That's incre- that is crazy. Do you miss looking at the stars? He's gonna look at the sky and be dumbfounded. Brother, look up. Hi. My god, no wonder he has no hope. Imagine looking at the sky for a first time. In a long time. I mean, just by looking forward, like, he's gonna be seeing the sky. You do do a lot of killing, though, but, uh, I don't know. <laughs> That's with you and God. Understandable. Understandable. Very true. God, I want him to lock up so bad. Please let him do it this episode. Jesus Christ. He's going to realize the world isn't so corrupt when he locks up. Oh, damn. That's what he sees. Jeez, how does he get past that? That illusion. Look at that night sky, man. God. Oh? What has he discovered? Y'all don't believe in, like, safety rails or something? I don't trust this. What's happening? Something's going to happen. He will surely die. If he tortured. Bro. Brother. Jesus. Did he grab him by the book or did he get him by the arm? That is some strength. Oh my god. How crazy is the water? He should be fine. Just drop him. Oh, it looks like he's going down. There's no way this man's dying here. 
Come on, we can't lose another person with this kind of knowledge. Bro. Oh. oh, how is the holding? Jesus. It's hanging him right now. Oh my god. How can you speak like that? Oh my god. Even if I die, this world will continue. Oh no. Who's maintaining these bridges? Fuck's sake. You still got living to do, bro. Yeah. Oh no. God damn it. How fast was the river going? You can't survive this? Can't like just like, swim to the side? I don't know. Was it too deep? Do you not know how to swim? If he did die there, then he also died smiling, which is a nice thought. Subdeacon from before. Oh, are they talking about the monk? You do be having a monk haircut. Oh, here he is. Yep. I thought that was a hat for a second, but yeah, he's like, the top of his head is bald, obviously. He looks like a Vinland Saga character. I think a lot of them do, too, for it's that kind of style. Damn, so he's chosen option two. Good on you. This man's been through some shit with those scars. This is my kind of monk. Right, so that was Orb on the Movements of the Earth, episode 5. Uh, another very good episode there. Unfortunately, it looks like we did lose grass. I feel this uh, series is not going to be gentle with the deaths. Um, I'm, I, I fear for everyone that we're going to meet now, unfortunately. Especially Oxy, because he does seem to be the main character of this segment. So, I guess we'll see. I'm, I'm getting very uh, to your eternity vibes. Um, but yeah, good episode. Uh, I like that he's chosen option two here. He's gone to the monk who can help him because he can't read. But I like that he is kind of choosing to potentially discover what is uh, going on up in the sky and going, up on, on, going on in the world. And hopefully he finds some reason to live. And I hope he actually gets to look at the night sky and not see giant eyeballs everywhere. Um... But yeah, overall, a very good episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction today. Have an interesting day, and peace out.